Uh, my son, man, say what's up, y'all. What's up? <laughs> Probably Jewel. Uh, Maverick, M A V E R. Uh, whoo, C K. <laughs> uh, about to be two in September. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, no doubt, no doubt. Uh, I mean, it was huge, uh, not just for my family and I, but, you know, believing in what, you know, this organization is trying to get done and what Nick and, and Coach Levy is building. So it's, it's definitely a blessing. And, uh, you know, I'm glad we can put that behind us and, and get back to work. Brandon, you've been through a contract extension before. Was yeah. there anything you learned from the first time around, this time around, of what things you wanted in this deal? Nah, nah, you know, I, I trust my agent, Ryan Toner, uh, to be able to do that. And uh, I got full trust in him. And, uh, you know, for me, I just stay back, continue to work, and kind of let him handle that. And i uh, got a lot of respect to the way that he does it and go about his business. Um, so I'm blessed to be able to have a, a great representation. Oh, yeah, I mean, you, times like this, you know, being here at OTAs, being able to just get some of those live throws, and then, you know, this summertime come, uh, be able to get the guys together and kind of just keep that, you know, thing going before going into training camp. As, as we all know, everything is just about reps. Yeah. 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 I'm gonna keep it simple. Pep is, uh, is special and uh, you know a great mind. Uh, you know, got a lot of trust in him and uh, just trying to help him be right. And uh, you know, we love going to work with him every day. Is there a level of excitement just knowing that y'all will be doing something different uh, as, a, as a unit? Yeah. I mean, absolutely, absolutely. Oh yeah, yeah. I mean, that kid's special. You can just tell it. You know, when you you talk with someone, you just get that feel about a guy, and um, you know the way that he goes about his business. Obviously, right now uh, he's not going with us, but you know his focus and paying attention to the little details that he can pay attention to. Um, I like him, and uh, I can't wait to get to work with him for sure. Yeah. Yeah. You know, guys are bought in, you know, and believing in that message that, you know, Coach Lovey is portraying. Um, you know, he brings a lot of energy every day. Um, got a lot of respect for him and coaching this, in this game for a long time. So uh, we're all excited. Brandon, you kind of talked about this second ago with Davis seeing what he did last year. Was that yeah. part of the reason that you want to ensure you were happy to build up the stuff? Absolutely. No doubt. Yeah. What kind of growth do you see from Davis? Since just, you know, yeah. Uh, I just think his uh, his leadership, you know, his confidence, just really taking control of that huddle. You know, he's not that rookie anymore. He's coming in. He knows that's his huddle, um, and and that's what you look in for your quarterback. And he's definitely doing that. Brandon, um, using AJ Cantwell, he said he's, got, he's kind of figured Lovey out. Yeah. He's pretty quiet. Yeah. You don't want to piss him off. No, yeah, exactly right. It's like he's like a parent. You don't want to disappoint, right? <laughs> exactly. What do you say about the nigga just mentioned mentioned Mitchell a moment? Yeah. But I'm in several new additions. Yep. Yeah, I mean, all hands on deck. We got a lot of special guys on this side of the ball that we added, not just at the receiver position, but in the backfield, you know, whether it's from tight ends, you know, at the offensive line. Um, I think, you know, Nick did a great job in the draft and then, you know, free agent wise. So, like I said, the biggest thing that I see right now is just everyone's bought in and, and everyone's unselfish. And I think that's what, uh, where a great offense starts at, just unselfishness. What's the biggest adjustment for a rookie receiver? We might ask you guys last year about. Uh, I, I would say the biggest thing is just, you know, slowing the game down again. Obviously, college to the league, game get a little faster. So how fast you can uh, slow that game down is, is going to be critical. Why is it important for you as a veteran to be at an optional team activity? Uh, you know, to lead, you know what I mean? Obviously, they look at me to be able to help lead in, in areas and – if I'm not here, it's going to be hard. Obviously, there's been some time I'm away from my family, but you know, when I can be here, I'm definitely going to be here to help lead and set that that standard that we all looking for for the season. Some new faces on the defensive backfield. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know, Steve played with him in college. Uh, you know, he's played a lot of ball. Guy, guy is smart. Um, you know, look forward to having him on my team. And then Sting, and that kid is a. Uh, I mean, what he's done in college uh, was awesome, and I look forward to, for him to be able to come in and do that here as well. When do you, when, when do you know about rookies? They, feel, I, I a lot game of time. Guys. Game time. Yeah, game time. So Colts week. We, you know, week one, you know what I mean? That's when you kind of, you know, know about the rookies. Practice is one thing, obviously, but, you know, it's uh, you really learn about a rookie in that game time. But I think our rookies is, uh, you know, got, got that, got something to them. Lovey kind of mentioned that 
couple there more. Was a, there's a little bit more of experience. This yeah. That the guys who were brought back were brought back for a reason. Just yeah. With that familiarity and also having Pab still on staff and coaches, does that make it a little bit easier to transition from what happened last year to this year? No question. You know, we still got a lot of guys that that's on this staff, and uh, you know, you may see as a new head coach, but obviously these guys have been around, uh, and that, that makes things a lot easier. The vibe of the team usually comes from the coach. No question. I mean, as you can see, we all excited and having fun. So I think that speaks for itself for sure.